Hey water signs and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your daily love reading for December 9th. I'm going to tip you on down here. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in that order. Whoa. Okay. All right, Cancer, you guys have the Knight of Wands in reverse. Pisces, you guys have the Knight of Swords in reverse. And Scorpio, you guys have the Seven of Cups in the upright. Your guys' shared energy is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, clarified by the Two of Cups and the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Your bottom of the deck is the Lovers, big decisions um, moving forward. Um, debating whether to give somebody a second chance or whether to move on single for some of you. But it's time to follow your heart. Do what you want. Um, escape any toxic energy that you guys are dealing with. Uh, yeah, the gift the gift from the universe is here. It's waiting for you. It's um, Right now you're going kind of through a shitty time, but um, you are going to come into... A relationship with your soulmate or a someone who feels like your soulmate. Um, I don't see it happening um, in in the next two weeks. However, um, it's going to be after that because um, there's something that's standing in the way of bringing in this gift. Uh, Cancer, you guys are dealing with a fire sign. Um, heavy Sagittarius energy here with the Wheel of Fortune and. Uh, the Knight of Wands being in reverse. So um, you are not getting a new beginning with this fire sign, with this Sagittarius. Um, and it's really... Uh, well, here, let me get some clarifiers. Cancer males. Thank you. Six of Swords, Cancer females. All right. So uh, Cancer males... You guys are dealing with uh, a Sagittarius that you are having a hard time moving on from, moving away from. Um, you uh, need to heal from the heartache of this relationship with this person in order for your new beginning and your true soulmate to come in. This you thought was your soulmate. It's not, it's, uh, not for this group of you. Um, the universe is waiting to bring this person in until you can let go of this heartache, let go of uh, this... Um, sadness and move into a more positive direction into a direction of healing and that is when your true soulmate will come in cancer females you are um you their secrets around this fire sign um as well as you're being guided to listen to your intuition you know intuitively who your true soulmate is and right now you are not with that person it's time to move forward um move Move into a place of being able to receive. You guys kind of have a lack um, uh, mentality going on right now. The universe is here and ready to bless you, to give you this gift. Um, it's just telling you to listen to your intuition. The universe is telling you what you need to know. You just have to listen. What's the outcome for cancer today? The Page of Swords. Yeah, nobody's speaking their truth. Nobody's speaking their mind. And um, that's something that needs to be uh, accomplished in order for this blessing to come in for you. All right, Pisces. You guys are dealing with uh, an air sign or a fire sign. Um, for Pisces males, you guys are very defensive when it comes to somebody else. You could be feeling insecure about somebody um, trying to... Uh, move in on a relationship that you are having. Uh, it's, it's, it's a good thing to stand your ground, but make sure you are telling the truth when you're doing it as well as, uh, there's a difference between being overly defensive and standing your ground. Make sure that, um, you, uh, are aware of that, but mo mostly, um, come in and speak your truth. Uh, you're going through a rough time right now, but there is light at the end of the tunnel. There is the sun coming up on the horizon, and you are going to be able to get this new start with your soulmate. So um, 
remain confident and stay strong. Uh, Pisces females, you guys are dealing with somebody that uh, you broke a commitment with. Um, this relationship just wasn't working out for you. Uh, it's time to heal in order to bring in those gifts and a new beginning um, with prosperity as well. You guys all have soulmates here waiting for you, life partners for some of you. Um, but there is commitment here, long-term commitment relationships. Outcome for Pisces. All right, the two of swords in reverse. So you're making a decision, making a choice. Um, for you, Pisces females, you guys are making the choice to leave a relationship. For you, Pisces males, you guys are uh, making a choice to stand your ground and fight for what you want. Either way, both of you guys have a new beginning coming and a soulmate that you're going to be able to spend uh, uh, your time with. All right. Scorpio, Scorpio males, you guys are uh, feeling quite confused. Somebody has um, told you some information that is not quite the truth. Yeah, look at that, the Seven of Pentacles. Just be patient for you, um, uh, Scorpio men, because the truth is going to come out. You're going to come out of that cloud of confusion. The people that you're dealing with are going to as well. Um, just be patient, continue to work on yourself, and when time is right. Your new beginning will be here. Your gift from the universe will be yours and you will be able to move forward with the person you're waiting on. Just continue to work on yourself. Um, they're going to get uh, things figured out for themselves as well. Scorpio females, you guys are dealing with an earth sign male um, who is confusing the shit out of you. He could be playing some mind games as well. Um, yeah. Give it an outcome card for Scorpio. Yeah, strength. So um, rem remember just to um, to face fear, to not let this debilitate you, to move forward um, because it is going to become clear to you. Uh, for me, the seven card is a sign of soulmates as well. So Scorpios, you guys are both dealing with soulmates who are going to come out of this cloud of confusion after the time of Sagittarius. And that is when you guys will get your... Uh, new beginning from the universe, your gift of abundance. All right, one card for our water signs, please. Thank you. All right, heart to heart conversation. So the time has come where you guys need to honestly discuss your feelings with each other, whether that's to continue to move forward and work on this relationship, or whether it's to end the relationship that you got going on, it's very important that you guys discuss your feelings with each other because uh, the universe is here and ready. They're just waiting for you to speak your truth and to have these conversations with your soulmate. Um, and after the time of Sagittarius, I do see um, relationships going in a lot better direction. So for the next couple weeks here um, till December 17th, it, it might be kind of rough, but um, now is the time to speak your truth and decide what it is that you guys want going forward. So I hope you guys have a beautiful Sunday. I will see you next time. God bless.